What's going on, everybody? This is Super TNT doing more Wi Fi Thursday, and here's a free battle with um, Battle Spot free battle with someone named Jordan. And he's running a Lapras, Semi Sage, Raichu, and Charizard. So I think this should be a pretty good match. And I'm just gonna run, let this free, let me just have the screen stay there for a little bit. And we'll be getting into the match right about now. So here we go. Right when this starts. So find this dude named Jordan, free Wi Fi. I mean, Battle Spot, because I couldn't really find anybody to do a Wi Fi battle. So he starts with his ride chew and his Charizard, and I saw my flag on in my road and predicted anything. Pretty much predicting out how he's going to start out. So I went for the Earthquake, getting rid of the ride chew. And the reason why I went for that, because. <laughs> Val Mansion or Manchon, however you want to say it, knows what Raichu likes to do all of the time. And it always does it. It always hits me. So I just want to hear that Raichu. So that Chuzzle goes for that Dragon Claw, and oh, that did a lot of damage. So I sent out this Lapras, and I was like, I didn't want to take another Dragon Claws, and I didn't know, and, it, and he revealed that it's Charizard, basically Charizard X, so. I was gonna kill it with I was gonna kill it with a vote switch, but it ended up not working out for me later on. So like, yeah, I, I went for U-turns. I didn't want to take out any ice move or any dragon move I was gonna send out, but I ended up going for vote switch anyway. So I didn't have any proper switchings anyway. So uh, yeah, again, I just threw out, I threw out um yeah I threw out vote switch and yeah you see that that's a decent mode, but still. <laughs> Still, I had to have to throw out my flag on anyway, because I didn't want to risk throwing out my um, my Jolteon. So it ends up dying anyway to a heat wave, but my Mawa avoided it. So that was unlucky for him because my Erika, the Mawa, you should already know, when it starts Mega Evolving, it starts destroying. Because <laughs> she's a destructioner, she'll take your picture and you'll just die right after. <laughs> So yeah, my room's out right now, and basically, yeah, you know how it goes. Warp, Digivolve, you know. You should subscribe to Magnitude. <laughs> He's the reason why I did this, because I actually like the way, I always like the way he does that kind of stuff. So I'm going to sucker punch that Charizard X, and then Hydro Pump it. I was like, I didn't want to lie, because if it were alive, and I killed the Lapras, you'd basically sweep my team with that. So now that that threat's out of the way, all I have to deal with is Lapras with Ice Beam. And as you can see, that did nothing to Rotom. <laughs> that did absolutely nothing. So he turned into Simi Sage, and I'm thinking, alright, I could go for Sucker Punch, but I'm thinking, it might not kill. So I just went for the Volt Switch. Volt Switch out. Because all I can do is burn with my um, Rotom, and I, it was a, it'd be a waste for me to go for a burn. So I went up to my Jolteon, my Meta B. As you can see, in, in the free battle battle spot, they don't they don't display your Pokemon name, which is kind of sad. So he went for the power up punch, and he went for the hydro pump on Jolteon. He, I guess he was predicting me to do the ball switch, and that didn't have health. So I went for the sword dance. So it's basically a wrap, unless these guys got the priority moves that do a lot of damage, which I highly doubt it. So a sucker punch semi sage, it's definitely dead. And I just give Lapras the laser cannons. It was a GG's. I could have did a lot. I could have did better plays, but it, it was still it was still good on my part. So I'll catch you guys later for next week. Next week for Wi-Fi Thursdays. See ya.